zooming in to get the scout right now. That's him up there, by the wheel. Okay. So I have to raise both counterweights. I need to use them both. Bravo, Watson. Get in the fucking window! Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna go for the rightmost wheel first. So, uh, I remember to get the scout. Hello! I need to start jump killing enemies. If I get if I get an achievement for slide assassinating, maybe I get an achievement for I just I can't fucking talk. I'm sorry. Oh, fuck. Fight me! That's a master. Me, me, me. Ow! Well, fuck. All right, I wanted to do that selfie anyway. It's so hot in here! I hate summer! Summer used to be my favorite season because, um, no school. And then it used to be winter because I freaking love rain. But now, winters are so disappointing up here because we don't fucking get rain. I think my new favorite season is probably spring. We get more rain in the spring than we do in the winter. Oh, yeah, that's- Xiao, you fucking horse sack. Oh, nice. Eh, 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 and I miss. Ow! Do it! Thank you. That's all four. All right, I got the full sink! Yeah! That's all I care about. All right, that's one counterweight down. Oh, I could have come up here, got the artifact, and crushed them. <gasps> Damn it! Oh, that would have been so cool. Oh well. Uh, those are noise makers, which I'm still full on. So let's go back. I'm gonna jump assassinate you just because. There we go. Okay, now don't move. You're in curtains. Don't move! You bastard. There we go. He stopped an inch before he got to me and I couldn't move. That would have sucked. Okay. I need more jump assassinations! Can I by any chance? I'm going to leave! Clever maneuvering by yours truly. Yeah, I want him to go away so I can jump assassin or not. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> His ah! Little late there, bro. Okay, I'm just playing with this guy now. I'm gonna get brawler gold because of this guy. I want to jump assassinate him. I want credit. I want to get the achievement. I know. Okay, I'm gonna wait for him to get a little further away. I don't think he's gonna move. You fucking suck. There we go. Alright, that's another one. I have no idea how many of those I've done. another one. Okay. Now it looks like I have to wait till this guy turns around. Okay. Meh! Okay. More, more, more jumping kills. I'm doing it this time. That's closed for some reason. Okay. Wait, where's the wheel here? Oh, oh, it's below me. I see it. Okay, it's below me. All right. This is the last gate. This is it. Now we just have to find Wang Yang Ming. Nope. And end him. Okay, now that door's open. I even got full sync. Oh, that mu- 
music is getting intense. This is it, the final hour. Wait, how do I get to those counterweights? Let's see if I can do this. There we go. Wow, that music is awesome. Bravo, composer. I don't know who you are, but very well done. It's beautiful. I'll take Assassin Silver. All right, I left. I can't run. There he is. This is it. I will not stealth kill you. We will have honor battle. You old fuck. Okay. <laughs> not quite yet. Let's do it a little bit later. Give me a moment to look at my stats. Alright, I've just assassin all the way, except for the first level that was Shadow, but that was a tutorial, so that wasn't my fault. Oh look! I'm missing one shard! Again! But I did get counter damage and I increased firecracker ammo about fucking time. Okay. I don't really care about helix boost upgrade, I don't use it all that much. Alright, sweet! Increase the maximum amount of firecrackers. The enemy will now take damage when I counter. Oh, that is very useful. Sweet! Alright, I think this is it, guys. The final boss fight! Your actions here have only delayed the inevitable. Okay. Slowing these savages will have only angered them. They will see this as a betrayal and launch a full-scale assault. They You're not wrong. Reach my land. The wall will hold them back. Your land. You think your successes matter? China is just a piece of the prize. AC2 theme. We will rule the world. <laughs> All right. And the box you so kindly presented us will be yet another tool to achieve a time of peace. Peace? You think you're a hero now? I don't want your world, your control. It's not peace if the, pe if the people don't have any say in it. Your box is lost, assassin. Already out of China, in the safe hands of my fellow Templars. Then another assassin will find the box. That will be their destiny. Mine lies here with you. So is this the same box? Because he sent it out of China. It could have been anywhere, meaning it could have shown up in the... Ah, oh, that's cool! Anyway, it might be. Vengeance! Xiao Jun's actions have stopped Sang Yong's plans, but also angered Elton Khan and the Mongolians, who have now launched a full-scale assault on the Great Wall. With all the destructive carnage, Xiao Jun must hunt Sang Yong down and finally put an end to his and the Templar in China. Are you telling me he's going to run? This is the end, Zhang Yong. There is no end to run. Well, apparently- oh. Well, I already fucked up! <laughs> God damn it! No, I left to run now! Go, 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 go! Oh my god, okay. Oh! Da. Oh, the AC2 uh, remake or whatever. Freaking cool. Very cool. Hello. Fuck me. This reminds me of that Castle Rock level in uh, uh, Rayman Legends. Oh, my bad. <laughs> I looked up to think Rayman Legends. I didn't notice the fire was coming right towards me. Okay, let's try that again. Down we go. Me. Me. He thinks he's a hero. He's like, we will achieve a time of peace, and I'm dead already again. And it's like, you will not stop us. But I'm gonna fucking run. <laughs> but fuck this shit. So perhaps the contents of the box were not Shao Jun's to discover. <sighs> okay. Eh. Eh. I was gonna jump assassinate that guy, but he can go flying back too. Oh, oh my god, holy shit. Just missed it. I mean, almost missed it. Holy fuck. Okay, jump up, and then back, and then back again. Up, jump! Combat roll! There was one, but there isn't. Oh, that guy got fucked. Uh, not in the good way. Okay. What was that bullshit? Left trigger and X. Didn't do anything. 
Maybe A and X will be better suited for my needs. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'll jump. Eh. Go, 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 go. I'm dying a lot today, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> what can I say? I'm so tired. Oh, my God. Ah! I'm gonna beat this game today! I think I'm dead. Nope, not dead. Okay. God dang it! Stop it! That's scary. I don't like heights. I don't like falling. <sighs> like, what is it? The, the boss fight for Uncharted 3 or something or other? Yeah, stressful for me. Oh, that was a rope swing. I just jumped to my death. <laughs> Shit. There we go. <laughs> All right. Keep it moving, people! Oh my god, that was fast. Stop it, you make me flinch. There he is. Stop running away like a little bitch. A little Templar bitch. You should have just killed him while he wasn't looking. Oh! Instincts, bitch! Oh! Alright, this is getting a little nuts. I want the artifact. Okay, keep it moving. Keep it moving, people. I like how on these like chasing running sequences, all the enemies are very conveniently facing the other way. <laughs> oh shit! Made it. Down we go. Down. Oh my god, that was close. Holy crap, that's awesome! Keep it moving! Don't stop for anything! Except, wrong way, fuck. Alright, this way. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh my god, I was expecting the other one to drop. I don't know how I'm still alive. Wait a minute. There might be an artifact this way and I want it. Yup, okay. <laughs> I want it. Great Wall of China is on fire. It is falling apart. I have a target to chase, but wait. Artifact. Okay. Up we go. I'm just gonna leave that guy. Fuck him. Oh, he thinks he's safe. He might be. Look at how many guys he's got. Well, oh, when he shut the gate. Yo, prick! All right, whatever. It's right here. A little distraction could help me here. Okay, so how many times has he, she said that in this playthrough? Like seven. All right. You better run. Okay, is he, was he talking to his guy, saying like, seriously, bro, you should leave, or this is not gonna end well? Okay. <laughs> Oh! Wait, where did Sang Yong go? Did he leave? You know what? Can you, if you could turn around, that'd be fabulous. Why don't you go ahead and turn around? Nyeh! Oh, whoops. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Artifact! Is there a sync point up there? Might have been. Oh well, I don't fucking care. You guys gonna have a conversation? No, okay. Nyeh! Nyeh! I really want that achievement. Probably have a few more guys to go. Here I come. Okay, um, you both can look. Actually, fuck it. You guys can both get blinded in the face. Nyeh! Nyeh! Okay. Go, 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 go. There he is. Oh, take a moment to pause and take in this moment. We're about to end this playthrough, ladies and gents. It has been a wild ride, and now Sung Young is dead! <laughs> that was cute. Oh my god. Oh! In the mouth. Or if you're Canadian, the mouth. Wow. Do not flatter yourself, Sang Yong. You have to die for China to have hope again. 
I started this journey for vengeance. But I've understood now that it's pointless. I have found a better goal to pursue. And what is that? Justice! Peter, <laughs> a new tomorrow for China and its people. I will undo all that you have done. I will rebuild the Brotherhood and recruit those who wish to make our land a place of freedom. Those ready to die to fight men like you. Your Templar world will not happen. The assassins will rise again. <laughs> Victoria the Assassini! Oh, that was awesome! Wow. Oh! Yes! Sweet! And I got all shards. I finally, I finally 100%ed a fucking level. The last one of the game. I did it! Woo! Yay! All right, that's it. Oh my god. Of course, she has to have that heroic pose and the heroic speech at the end. But oh, that was awesome. Wow. Honestly, though, I was expecting some type of epic sword fight, but no. I'll take a running around the destroyed Great Wall of China. I'll take it. That's fucking cool. All right. Xiao Jun can now destroy wooden shields with a single heavy attack. Oh, yes. When the helix bar is full, block an attack and press left and right trigger at the same time to engage helix kill mode. When an enemy is in range, press X or Y. Oh! Replay the game but with all the abilities and upgrades you obtain during normal mode available from the beginning. Yes! In New Game Plus, your level score is also multiplied by two, so you can easily obtain the upgrades you missed and acquire the New Game Plus exclusive ones. <gasps> oh, that's awesome! Thank you! That's perfect. Oh, in New Game Plus Hard, you only have a single health bar and enemies react much faster. Existing abilities and upgrades are carried over and your level score is still multiplied by two. Wow. Oh, there's Eve Gimo. Again, I think is how you say his name. Father of Assassin's Creed. Kind of. No, actually not really. Um, Jade Raymond is behind that, but that's it! The first Assassin's Creed Chronicles game is done! I'm so happy we finally got a game where we got to play Xiao Jun. I love the side scroller, however, I really would have loved, you know, like maybe just like an Assassin's Creed Rogue or a Liberation type thing, like or just a really short game with the same mechanics as the rest of the games. But this felt fresh, you know, it added to the lore and it continued from already existing lore, you know, from Assassin's Creed Embers. Everyone was wondering what happened with Xiao Jun after she left uh, Tuscany. So it was so nice that we got some closure for that. And um, oh, they even copyrighted Ezio's family's theme. Oh, that's crazy. There it is. Oh, wow, that is amazing. That is epic. Okay, if there's any song I'm going to be getting from this game, it's going to be this one. I will say, okay, I love the music. Gameplay was really fun. However, I will say that um, games, uh, Game Informer was right. Um, it starts off really strong and then kind of dwindles by the end of it. But it's still fun. I still had a great time. And I cannot wait for Assassin's Creed Russia with Nikolai Orlov. Oh my god, I can't wait. And Assassin's Creed uh, Chronicles India with Arbaz Mir. Unfortunately, I haven't read Assassin's Creed Brahmin, so I don't know his story. Um, you know, maybe I'll maybe I'll get Brahmin before I play India. And I really like Xiao Jun. Um, her new voice was really good. Her new voice actress was really good. Um, another thing Game Informer said was that sometimes she can sound British, like when she says, Got it! Absolutely, she can totally sound British. But voice acting was still great. I'm kind of sad Roger Craig Smith didn't make a reappearance as Ezio. Um, that was kind of a bummer, but at least he was in the game to some extent. That was amazing. Oh, we have the Ezio theme again. Oh my god, that guy's name is Seven. George Costanza, your wishes come true. There's a real person named Seven. Yeah, the, other than that, I don't really have a whole lot to say. I liked the story. Um, it was kind of straightforward, though. There wasn't a whole lot of depth to it, I guess. Um, I mean, there was some, but it definitely, it wasn't the strongest story plot, obviously, since this is just sort of like a, a platforming spinoff. Um, it was still really good, though. Um, so Xiao Jun really is the last assassin because Wang Yangming was killed, but um, she's gonna build it back up. 
and I don't know if she was successful. I would hope she was, um, but I'm not sure. I'm thinking that the box Etsu gave Xiaojun is the exact same one from Freedom Cry and from, from Rogue, because they sent it away, and they never said where, but it could have been anywhere. I mean, Templars and Assassins have allies all over the world, so I, I want to think that they sent it, because, I mean, it was... I don't know why I first found it on a ship. I am so excited. I'm more excited for Russia than for India, obviously, because I don't know our Bosmir story. But, um, it, excuse me. I've read the subject for a uh, graphic novel series, so I know Nikolai Orlov's whole story, and it is tragic. He was just a cool dude. He was just a, he was just a really cool character, and he seemed very unique to me. So it's really, really exciting that we're going to see him again, and we're going to get to play as him. Like, how fucking cool is that? I mean, we'd only ever seen Xiaojun in a little short film. Like, what is it? Like, 20 minute, half an hour long short film? If that. And then we got to play as her in her own game. And then we haven't seen Arbaz or Nikolai. Um, we haven't seen them outside of graphic novels. And now they're getting their own games too in this Chronicle series. So I think this Chronicle series was a really great idea. It's a way of expanding the non-game lore to the game audience. And let them experience these characters. And I, I think that's brilliant. So good on you, Ubisoft. I'm very happy you decided to do this. However, let me see. Yeah, uh, basically three Assassin's Creed games in one year, which is, it's 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 too much. It's cool, but it's too much. We got Row, we got Unity, and now we have this. And debating on when India and Russia come out. Maybe India and Russia will come out before um, 2016. I don't know, but then there'll be four, maybe even five Assassin's Creed games in one year. That, uh, it, it's too much. So Ubisoft, it's a big company. I get it. They have teams all over the world working on a bunch of different shit. But you gotta slow down a little bit. Like, just, you know, slow it down. <laughs> I mean, your games are great, but it's really beginning to look like you're struggling to keep up with your own schedule. I mean, with Unity's launch, for example. I'm not, I'm not gonna sit here and act like nothing bad happened, because that was a very rocky launch and it had a lot of problems, especially on the PC version. I'm not gonna sit here and pretend like the game launched perfectly. Like, I love Assassin's Creed, but I'm not a blind fangirl. Like, there have been problems in these games. There have been bugs. I know even Assassin's Creed 3 had, had its problems, and that was three years ago. And, um... Yeah, so, it just, you gotta slow down a little bit, because I realize you're a big company, and you can get these games out really fast, but it helps to slow down, and really analyze what you're doing, so, you know, you know what needs to be fixed before the game launches, because day one patches are becoming a little too frequent. It's becoming a habit with not just Ubisoft, but a bunch of other developers, and that's not something that should be done. A good way to, to help fix that? Bring the downloadable demos back. Bring the downloadable free demos back. That way we can play a short portion of the game before the game comes out. And that way we can decide, you know, if we want to get the rest of the game or not. And it'll help with feedback. And I, I just, I don't, I don't see any problem in that. I mean, you're already making playable demos for these gaming conventions like E3, which comes up in two days from now. So I'm super excited. And yeah, so I don't see, I mean, it's, it's a, it's a win-win situation. We get to play the game before it comes out and get feedback if we want to, and it, it, we sort of like become playtesters before you release the whole fucking game. So I'm sorry, I'm ranting on, but Ubisoft, not in every single case, but in this case with Assassin's Creed, gotta slow down. I realize it's like your prize stallion of your of your studio, okay? And it's the prize stallion of my whole fucking life, <laughs> but you gotta slow down a little. If anything, just one game a year. Like, please? I mean, yeah. It's it's becoming overwhelming. Whereas when a new Assassin's Creed game comes out, it's less and less exciting. Because you're like, alright, here we go again. Instead of, ah, it's been a whole two years, I'm so excited! Now it's like, okay, it's been about uh, five months, and uh, let's do it again, hooray! I love Assassin's Creed, and I, I mean, it's cool getting a new game every year, but you gotta slow down. Because it looks like your schedule is catching up with you, and um, you're starting to push these games out. I realize you delayed Unity, but in all honesty, you should have delayed it again. Well, uh, I think we're about to reach the end of the credits here. Um, looks like we're getting to all the copyright stuff. I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of Assassin's Creed Chronicles China, because I certainly did. It was really fun, and I cannot fucking wait for India and Russia. Like and favorite if you did, subscribe if you want to see more, and 
I will see you guys in my next video. Fe oh! We have a secret cutscene. Mentor. The Emperor is dead. The elixir of life? Yes. It killed him, as you had planned. His son will follow in his footsteps. Oh my god. The war will protect the people now. And so shall we. She did rebuild it. Mentor. Last time we talked. You were telling me about Marsfeld before the precursor box. Who is that? Ah. Ezio's great gift to me. Yes. I never discovered what the box could do. But the artifact, and my obsession with it, taught me a great lesson. Perhaps the greatest of lessons. What was that, Mentor? She who seeks revenge should remember to dig two graves. That's right. That's very right. Oh my god! We saw old Xiao Jun. She rebuilt it! She did it! She did it! Oh, that's so... Oh my god, that's awesome! Holy shit! Wow. Who was that guy? Maybe it doesn't matter. It's just one of her assassins. But, oh, she grows to be older, at least. I don't know how old she was. But, um, she grows to be older, and she, she fulfilled her promise. She rebuilt the Brotherhood. And I think, from what I understand, she was on the Great Wall of China, so maybe that's where they are now. Like, watching the border. I don't fucking know. But, oh! That's so cool! Oh my god! Wow, that was a great note to end on. That was a great note to end on. But anyway, um, I'm gonna stop ranting now, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do my outro right now. So, again, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough of Assassin's Creed Chronicles China as much as I enjoyed bringing it to you. This was so fun, and I cannot wait for the other Chronicles games. Maybe we'll even have more after India and Russia. I have no idea, and you know what? Kind of hoping so. Maybe not, just not for a while, though. Sticking to what I said before, not for a while, though. Patience, Ubisoft. Patience. <laughs> anyway, like and favorite if you did enjoy, subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you in my next video. Farewell, friends. Oh god, they're flaying him. Oh shit. No, stay away.